Siete. Siete. I was out in the world today. And it made me think of George Herbert W. Bush Walker is the W. He's one of these people that had to have many names because he was destined for greatness and all that really happened was he was a guy that was in, in charge of something, became the CEO for a little while. And all that are remembered, all that is remembered, all the things that are remembered of all the things is his name. Out in the world watching the people in the lines, watching their sep separation from each other. It's not just segre segregation, it's separation. They're pulling away from each other. Yeah. And, um, it made me think of George Herbert Walker Bush and how in that story that there was a book like that big. Oh, see that thing. It was thicker than that. The book was thicker than that. It was by some woman named Kitty. It was written by some woman named Kitty. I'm trying to do an Ackard toll impression because I like him very much. And I, I sit there and I think, this is a guy that's sitting there doing a video. And his wife's in the other room saying, shut the hell up. And so he's gonna talk really quietly and he talks slow. Then because he talks quietly and slow, we are forced to listen. How can you ignore someone who talks quietly and slowly? It, it, it draws you, and he says such wonderful things. I mean that. Thank you, Eckhart Tolle. And then that book by that kitty woman, whatever her last name was, she's written other other biographies. She wrote The Bush Dynasty is what it was. It was something like that. And how Senator Preston, he was a decent fellow and stuff. And she talks about him. It was like I had to know for myself because you can only listen to what people say so much, this much, thus much, before it comes time. You have, to, you have to take a look into it yourself. Don't believe everything I say. You're only supposed to question it. And in questioning, if you have, have the will and or the guts, you can find out the real answer behind it all. It's that simple. You're not supposed to believe me. You're supposed to wonder if what I'm saying is true. Ta-da.
But in her book, what he said was when he didn't like someone, when somebody didn't like him and didn't play the game that he was playing, he'd always have to say, He's a hard guy to read. That was his way of saying he didn't understand somebody. He's a hard guy to read. Why didn't he understand? He couldn't understand why the guy wasn't just sucking up to him. It blows people's minds. He's a hard guy to read. And that's what we are coming to right now. Looking at those people out there in the world, just natural but only with the people that are with there's no turn around and talking to the guy behind you in line and saying yeah i'd fuck her or anything like that and he's looking at his wife and giggling it's nothing like that there's no communication whatsoever anymore and this is making us all a little bit hard to read.